Hi and welcome everyone to a new episode of Shakti Yoga and the Shakti Yoga Wheel. My name is Jessica Heinen. Welcome to this new episode where we work a little bit more therapeutically. So if you feel a little stuck in your side and having some issues to twist or find some length in your side body, this episode is for you. So we're going to start pretty easy by sitting on your left buttocks and bring the yoga wheel on your left hip. So you can lean a little bit against it because I want this yoga wheel to stay on my hips, not to roll away too far. So I want to keep contact here so I can push down, which lengthen my side body right under my armpits so I can find a little bit more length. And then I snuggle my torso over the yoga wheel. So what you can start with is just by bending that elbow and keep that slight push into your, onto your waistline. So the left arm lifts and you just lean over. Good. If you feel confident in this posture, you can straighten both arms and see if you can reach a little bit more for, more towards the side. Slide your ears back and just lean and lengthen over the yoga wheel. So the yoga wheel gives you an amazing support for this side stretch. So you can really focus on getting your, your right hip really heavy towards the floor so you can grow a little bit longer. Inhale, now bring both arms up and we're gonna switch sides. <clears throat> so sit on the other buttocks Keep your knees kind of like parallel, so the feet are parallel too, and then roll the wheel onto your right hip. Good. Again, you can either push down with your forearm or you can use your palm to push the wheel down and lengthen your side body so your ribs are moving away from your hip crease. Take a deep breath to inflate a little bit more into your kidneys and then lean over the left elbow, pushes into the outside of your yoga wheel and then lift your right arm or left arm, sorry, over your head. Find a little bit more length, good. And then stretch out both arms. So keep your shoulders parallel so your biceps are, is framing your ears and you really lean over it, good. Now soften your elbow towards the floor and then straighten the top leg out to the side. You can bring your hand right here onto your hip crease and then slowly scissor your feet and come into a side plank. So if you feel comfortable with this, not too much pressure, you can lengthen your bottom arm over and reach the right arm or left arm, is that now? because I'm mirroring you over your head. Okay. So we're gonna go into a side plank now. And you can feel the whole, the full benefit of this side stretch. Take a couple of deep breaths in and out. And guide this breath more into your back body. Nice. To come out of this pose, bend the elbow, bend the bottom leg, and slowly roll all the way back and down. Good, switch it up, take it to the other side. So you can keep your knees bent and just swivel the heels to the other side. <clears throat> roll the wheel really close to your hip so you actually touch the hip. Because when you come up and lean the full way, you wanna have the wheel in the right posture so it's not compressing your rib cage, right? Good, lean over, push the wheel down first so it's not rolling away. Keep your elbows looking towards the floor. The top leg is straightening out. Then take it, the bottom leg and roll so far forward that you can touch the floor with your elbow. Take that arm over your head. Yes. And then eventually straighten both arms and sink over your wheel. Breathe smoothly in and out. 
and then slowly bend the elbows, come all the way back into your seat. Good. Thank you so much for watching today this episode. I hope you feel that beautiful stretch in your side and you, you feel a little longer in your side body. Thank you so much for watching today. And if you'd like to visit us and learn a little bit more about the yoga wheel, please come onto our website, www.shaktiyogawheel.com. See you in the next episode. Bye everyone. Namaste.